Hey, what's up, my friends? Welcome back to my channel. Today, we're making a classic, delicious surf and turf dinner in a quick few steps. Let's get started. Step one: Let's season some off of our turf meat. Today, we're using steak, and the first step is really just to sprinkle some sea salt and massage it a little. Make sure the salt is covered on each of the surface. And of course, a good friend of our sea salt is our pepper. Seasoning with some chili powder if you are a spicy lover. step this very mysterious bottle which you cannot see the label is coriander just sprinkle a little cover it on each of the surface and this next spice is ground cumin it made fun of me that I put cumin on each every single of the dish and now look at the amount he put it on the steak we're just not gonna talk about it some parsley the next key component of our serve and turf dinner is of course the serve today we're using lobster tail to cut your lobster tail there are two ways first you can butterfly it on the back and today we're using uh, cutting through on the other side to keep it moist while you grill them. And to make a seasoning for the lobster tail, first gently melt the butter in a heating pan at a low, medium to low heat. And at the same time, just firmly press your lemon to make sure all the juices are coming out when you cut them. Cut them in half. Squeeze the whole lemon juice into your melted butter and just gently temper in them. Mix them together. Well, I have to admit one thing that when you cook this serve and turf uh, eat this recipe, you have to kind of have to uh, multitask a little bit because while we're prepping our lobster tail we put the uh, baked potato already in the oven and, and it's now ready to go um, I believe it's 400 for like 5 minutes till the potatoes are soft and then you squish them spray um, some of the olive oil and put them back in the oven to crisp it of course seasoning with salt and pepper and wherever you see fit and when your potatoes are in the oven we're now closer to nature we're coming to our outdoor grill now As you hear the beautiful birds singing and chirping, you'll feel good on this part because it's a light at the end of the tunnel. With all the surf and turf, it might sound a little heavy and of course you want it to pair it with some vegetables. Today we're doing sautéed garlic spinach. You put butter in it, garlic in it. And at the same time, your lobster tail is brushed, steak is seasoned. Now let's put into production. For the steak, I would say cook on each side for seven and a half minutes. And for the lobster tail, 
you want it to cook for our lobster tail, you definitely don't want to overcook it. We want it juicy on the inside, beautifully coloring on the outside. To enhance the flavor of our lobster tail, we want it to brush the previously prepared butter with the whole lemon juice on each of the lobster tail one more time. And look at it's that beautiful done. coloring. You might want to brush your lobster tails one more time, although they look perfectly cooked already to me. I wanted to suggest here, let's just take a minute to appreciate this beauty, this surf and turf, easy made dinner. Well, thank you everyone for watching this video. Please click the like button if you like this content and definitely try it at home and let me know in the comment area how you like this dish. Please subscribe to my channel for more. Thank you so much.